Ganyu sends the shot across. Good save from the Lord. Later on, coming in from deep. Imam Ibrahim is now aware of the danger. And of course, Nete also did it. The pitch has aided Chelsea to gain possession, but Danlard comes to Kotoko's rescue with yeah, the that's clearance. Brilliant. Straight away off his line to be the sweeper and sweeping it well. It's Anani trying to get to Ousose, but Danlard again comes out of his area to clear the danger. And here Madiama go in search of the opening goal. Danlard Ibrahim. And if the ball goes across the turf here, yeah, maybe Danla struggles to deal with it, but it's quite comfortable for him to get a hand on it. Kotoko were beaten with 10 men in Kumasi against Chelsea. And here they are. They're a man down, but two goals up, and the first half is over here at the Akun Park in Takwa. And the Premier League leaders, Kumasi Asante Kotoko, who lead the second place team on the log, Mediama Sporting Club, by two goals to nil in the backyard of Mediama. Appel scored from a towering header from Imore. Baba Musa sets up a Jebuati. He sends a Kelly cross. And Dunlad Ibrahim again is there for Kotoko. Somebody arrives at the far post and the shape of the ball is not bad, but look at Dunlad again. His starting position is always perfect. If it's on the line, it's Hodges. Corner taken. Dunlad makes a bold save. Yeah, that's great goalkeeping. If you step off your, off your line, make sure you're getting something on any gun. Not only something, but plenty on the ball. Kotoko have won 11 times, but Yama have won just four times. Kotoko somewhere! Brilliant save, Danlad Ibrahim, and there's a clearance from Nete. You know, get the ball past him, and it gets the shot away, but Danlad's positioning is good. He doesn't have to travel far to reach the ball, but... Asante takes it. Great save from Danlad, spectacular drive from Avonio out it's a world-class save it's it's a brilliant save by Dan Lad because the ball was well struck by Avlon on the volley and Dan Lad his position is Aaron Essel dust around on the right side he sends a cross two direct and two straight at goalkeeper and measure a good one in there but straight into that 60 yard box easy pick it who have the advantage now here is Avlon and Avlon good goalkeeping from Dan Lad and Avlon Got the ball to his weaker side and just it's a poor finish really. They didn't ask so much of Dan Lad. Dan Lad's positioning is good to be fair to him, but Annabella he puts one two looking for Anna. Dan Lad won't take chances, he's out. Latif Annabella. Great save from Dan Lad to deny Augustine Okra. Magnificent save! Sanabila was sending the ball into the box here. Kotoko is different. Nobody keeping an eye on Okra. And it's a wonderful header from him. But he could have also, you know, look at that. He's, it's, it's, it's a free header. It's, you, you're looking at Okra and thinking, could he have applied a lot more power in the middle as well? Free kick by Ashgold. Dealt with by Dan Lad Ibrahim. Play for Karela is back. Just look at the Kela. Yeah, we see the shot again, catch it so well, but just look at that lad. Amazing. Lovely pass laid onto the far side. That lad comes out and makes a brilliant save. Ejakum with a lovely pass here. The control excellent. Waited and waited. Yeah, we look at that Kamara Dini free kick again. Got it over the wall. Was zooming to the oh. corner by goalkeeper that lad with a brilliant stop. Gets the shot away, but not strong enough to be the goalkeeper. Another opportunity. Missed by Daniel Afriya Banier. Has to causing early problems for Kumasi Asante Kotoko. Yeah, he came from the short corner kick, Muntari. He'll send the boy into the ball. Banier should be doing a lot better from there. Kotoko's defending was poor. That's clearance. Yeah, shocking why that is. But again, you see Kotoko's back line easily gone through because the, the line is hard. The goal kick, actually, as we rightly indicated. Good call from the referee in the process. Yeah. Again, it's a fair game. He never gives up on any ball. That's, he's always looking for that. But that's, um, right, we've already seen Asma down the left-hand side, sending two crosses into the box. Haven't been the best, but fatal. 15, Hatsabok about... winning the contest in the yellow card. Good pass to Awaku. Awaku's cross. Saved by the lad. Of Kotoko, it's Awaku who... 
wasn't tracked from midfield, had a space to gallop in. Cross from Fatal Mohamed, Danlad comes out for it. On his left foot, goes for glory, and it's straight to Danlad. Yeah, caught that well, but long way out, straight down the middle for the goal. Inkum and Corsa combine. It's Inkum who delivers. Danlad reacts really well. Out to Corsa. And Danlad comes in with a very, very good reaction. Inkum's cross. Danlad comes out. He collides with Obin Jr. and stays down. To step off his line and get everything on the ball. Look at him. That is great goalkeeping. He knew the blow was coming. He took the blow, but eventually got the effort. They got the, the cross coming into the box away from it. JP brings the ball down. He turns, lays on the pass. Finishing is just not there. That nearly resulted in an awkward goal. Corner kick advantage. Four man well formed by Kotoko. Fisted out by Dan Ladd. Venom here. Hit it so well on target as well. Good goalkeeping from the young goalkeeper. Nicely fisted out. Yes, Prince Aqua. When will the comedy be over? Yeah, yeah, comes forward. But Dan Ladd was the quicker of the two. Great anticipation from Dan Ladd Ibrahim. Dan Ladd Ibrahim. It would have been injustice. It would have been injustice. The young goalkeeper there, Mankuna, waited here, looking for the goalkeeper to move. And the goalkeeper, with eagle eyes, stands on his line and there with a brilliant save. Good reflexes. Mohizu's long ball in, claimed by Dalad Ibrahim. Kasim Razak, he's up against Junior Biaku, but goalkeeper Danlad reading it well. Dino Chamusu sends a cross in. Good goalkeeper from Danlad Ibrahim. 10, puts one through for Romaric Dino. Great anticipation from Danlad Ibrahim to get the clearance away for the Ghanaians. Ibrahim Imuro is missed it completely, and there you see him straight off his line, narrowing down the angle and getting there first ahead of from the bench. And that drive looks decent from Angudo, but it's not beating the Ghanaian shot stopper.